Hey, 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 familia. What's happening? Just tuning in here with you. Facebook, Instagram. We're rocking it day number three. Let me know when you jump in, your name, where you from, or where are you right now on planet Earth? We never know, I'm just sitting up. Um, YouTube right now, getting all the platforms here, rocking it. Yes, yeah, so grateful. Yeah, what's happening? Hello, 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 everyone here. Present Scotland, New Brunswick, Canada, New York City. Yes, connecting Washington State to New Zealand. Connecting here the whole world, guys. That's what's happening. That's what we are doing. Yes, you hoo. There you go. All right, guys, here we go. How's everybody feeling today? So let me know if you are on day number one, you know, and you're just you're watching this for the first time. You've got two days to watch, right? Two free live trainings to rock and roll. Let me know if it's your num day number two that you're doing right now, or if you are actually on day number three, right down. Where are you guys? So we can connect right now and uh, rock it together, guys. This is so good. Yeah. Yeah, you made it live. So beautiful. So many amazing people. I'm so happy with this community we're creating, guys. It's really, really a blessing. I feel so, so grateful with all of you to just be showing up. Can you leave it open, please, so the air comes in? Awesome. Yeah. Good. Yeah, you, you just catch on. If it's your replay, it's good. It's okay, guys. Don't worry. You have all the recordings on the fan page right there. You can check them whenever you want and, and do the whole process because it is a process, guys. It is a process to amplify your energy and this is related to your purpose. This is related to how you show up in the world, your confidence, your trust, how to transform emotions, right? How to really ground into what are you aiming for in your life? Where are you focusing yourself in your life, right? It's so important to, to have a, a purpose, to have a focus, to to know where you're sending your arrow to the universe, right? So much energy is available to us all the time, but are we aware that wherever your energy is focused, your attention is focused, that is where your energy goes, right? Sometimes we forget about these things, right? And our energy is all over the place. Our thoughts are all over the place. We get caught up with the news and what people are saying and whatever's happening, right? So how to get back to that center, to that grounding, to that inner power, guys? And that's what today is all about. Yesterday, we burned down the house, right? We did some alchemy, a little bit of alchemy. Right? I'm not going to promise you that you're going to heal every part of you with the, 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 the three exercises we did yesterday, but they are very powerful if you continue doing them. Right, It's very powerful stuff. There's so much more that we can do, but it depends how committed are you 
to the work, right? So from here, we're ready to go to the third stage, which we call the incorement, going into your core. And I'm not just talking about guys like having a six pack, you know? I mean, that's cool, that's nice, like why not? But it's, it's not really about the six pack, right? It's really about finding that power from your core, learning to activate the base of your spine, the perineum pubococcygeus muscles, which are your, your pelvic floor, and then uniting that with what we call um, Uddiyana Bandha, which is the connection between the pelvic floor, and then you bring the navel in. And both of them, when they both activate, they create what we call the Hara. And that is your core. That is your house of empowerment. That is what many call the house of the soul. Why the house of the soul, guys? Because it's not just about um, um, your physical body. When you're empowered, when you're in your center, when you're in that confidence, guys, you are unstoppable. You, like, your fire is lit up, guys. You wake up in the morning, you know what you're doing, you know where you're going. You actually, you know, you gotta, you gotta open up to create more time because you just wanna do so much. You have so many possibilities. You have so many gifts. You have awakened, guys. Awaken your inner gifts. How many times have we focused inside and really asked ourselves, what are really my gifts? Why am I here on planet Earth? We forget about these things and we get into survival mode, into just working and like getting over, you know, the day or just waiting for the weekend. And challenges like now, like today, put us in a space of like, and now what? Now what with my life? I'm not that happy right now with my life. Like, I don't like my work. I don't like my diet. I don't like my lifestyle. Like, there's something that needs to change. This is what's happening, guys. We're having the opportunity of our lives right now. Thanks to this crisis, we're having the opportunity to open up to different layers of our purpose. And our purpose is connected to our core. It's like that passion. What drives you in life? Do you like serving others, for example, right? And what are you doing to serve others? Are you, are you training yourself on how to serve others, on how to help others? Not only your family, not only your friends, but if you like serving others, we need you right now on the planet. We need many of you, you know, if that's what you love. And are you being the best you can be? Because many people are like, all right, I'm a coach. I'm a yoga teacher already. I just teach a class here and there. I coach whatever clients I can get. And, you know, it's all good. Are you giving it all you got? Are you fully committed to serving the world, for example, right? Maybe your purpose is being a musician or, or being a dancer or a, or a painter or, or a constructor or an architect. Who cares what it is? But are you giving it all you got? Are you constantly studying? Are you constantly growing? Are you constantly expanding? Are you constant, constantly masterminding with other like-minded people that will help you take your purpose to the next level? Guys, it's the only way because there are patterns right now in society that keep us in this little comfort zone of mediocrity and we gotta choose are we gonna be one of the 99 percent or do we want to succeed from within right do we want to be the best of ourselves do we want to get to a moment that when we die we're like oh my god i lived my life a hundred percent I didn't just go there, you know, for whatever there was with good luck or bad luck. Good luck doesn't exist anymore. It's not part of your radar, okay? You're done with good luck or bad luck. You create your reality. And the moment you empower yourself, and you know you're creating your reality, you are committed to every thought you have, every emotion you bring in your field, every move you make, how you breathe, how you move, how you stand up, how's your posture, how many hours a day do you spend in social media getting lost, you know? Watching Netflix getting lost and losing your time. You know what I mean? No judgment, guys, I like it all. And I, I've had, you know, I have, I have a kid and I, I, I always, you know, play with him and do a lot of stuff that sometimes, you know, sometimes he's not the best for you, but we, we play around in society, right? We can play the game, but are you getting lost in those things or are you completely connected into your power, your core? 
So let me know if you're ready to go deeper into your core. Let me know with a yes if you're ready to go deeper into your inner gifts, into your energy, guys. I want to feel you guys because I'm going to give you all I've got, but I want to feel you too. All right? <laughs> so let me know. Give me a yes. Give me a heart. Give me whatever, in whatever platform you're at, whatever you want to share with, just showing me your commitment that you're ready, that you're going to put any distraction away and that you're going to be doing this practice with me together. We're together on this. Yes, ready. Yes, so ready. Yes, we are 100%. Yes, yes, committed, guys. Yes, that core is related to commitment. How committed are you in your life to give the best of what you've got, to embody the best of who you are in everything, your relationships, your purpose, your body, your health, your brain, your nervous system, your passion, your business, Everything, guys, there's no separation. Full commitment is full commitment, right? Full commitment, guys, there's no other way. <laughs> and then it becomes fun. Then you're like, hey, psh, 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 wake up. What's happening? I am committed or not. Go for it. <laughs> you become your father and your mother, but you become the best father and mother that you've ever had, you know, because we didn't really have the best father or mother. They're all human and they're all been carrying all these chains of how to educate their children and what's good and what's bad and what should be done and what shouldn't be done and what's not correct and what's correct, right? We've been lost there a little bit in society and it's okay, I love my parents so much. It's, they're giving all the best. But many times, uh, we've been very hard on each other as parents, you know? As parents, we want everything perfect. We don't want our children our children to, to have a, a pain or that to suffer or to have problems in life. So we try to always like tell them what to do, what's right, what's not right, what's going to make them suffer. We try to find the answers for them. And we are very judgmental many times. Like, you can do better. Come on, you've got this. Like, you know, my father was like that a lot with me, you know, and, and it caused me like oh, stress. Like I was never good enough. You know, I was never good enough for him. There was always more and more and more. And he did it from a place of like, Come on, Juanpa, I see you. You can do better. You know, it was from a good intention, but I recorded in my behavior, in my patterns, like I always have to be the best, but from a stressful space, guys, from a place of stress, not from a place of joy and celebration. Yes, I want to be the best. No, it was from a place of judgment. If I did something, I was, I could have done better. I could have said something better. I could have stopped that. That's my fault. I was so hard on myself. Guys, and I suffered so much in my life because of this. Give me a yes if you've been there or if still that happens to you. You know, I should be doing this. I should be doing that. And you're hard on yourself, right? Give me a yes if you feel me because I'm getting a little bit vulnerable here too. You know, when I tune into these parts, it's like how many times we betrayed our soul? How many times we didn't listen to us, right? And, and when you find out that the power of your soul is always there and it's related to your core and you're committed to going deep, then you're like, you know what? I'm not giving my power away. You know what? My father and my mother are inside of me. The moment I said that, guys, and I let go of what my parents thought was the best for me and what they wanted out for me and what I should be doing to satisfy my parents, you know, when I let go of that image of that part of my ego, Guys, my gifts just exploded. I started really embodying who I really was and not who they wanted me to be, right? And I stopped criticizing myself. I stopped being judgmental. I stopped being the most loving parent ever. I'm like, you've got this, Juanpa. Yeah, that was amazing. Yeah, of course, you can refine it. You know, you can be better here and there, but you're amazing, Juanpa. I became the best parent I could be, you know, and then I transmitted that to my son, you know, I tried to be the same because when he was born, I kind of was repeating the same patterns as my father. But then when I changed my own patterns, I changed my patterns with my son and my relationship with my son is the best ever. I'm his friend, but I'm also his, fa his father and I, I'm also like his, you know, he's like, okay, man, we've got this together. Let's do, let's do, let's, let's sneak and, and do s things together. You know, our secret stuff that we do, that we have fun and, you know, we play like kids, but he's all, also fully into his power, acknowledging his gift. So this is how we change humanity, guys, waking up our core, 
acknowledging, remembering who we are, and then passing that to the next generations. That's where the answer is, guys. Like, it's not on politicians. It's not on the people that are in the power right now. All, all that is going to fall apart at some point, guys. That's not working. We know that, you know? You can choose the, the president you want, but they're all puppets. It's all the same, guys. It's all ruled by the same families at the end of the planet. And, and instead of, like, being restrained by it and, and being limited by it, we're like, you know what? I'm here to empower myself. I'm here to give the best of myself. I'm here to wake up my inner genius and leave my legacy in this planet right now, right? Who's with me? Not only with your family, right? But leave your legacy with the whole world, guys. People are waiting for you for your message. People are waiting for you for your story. Listen to you, to like how you made it, where you've made it. You've got so much to teach others just by your experience. Not by the books you read, not by how many trainings you assisted. I mean, that's also good. But your experience is gold. It's golden nuggets for others. The moment you acknowledge that and you start speaking, like, from your core, from your heart, and you start sharing with others what you learned and why and what you did with that situation and not putting the mask that everything's cool. Be human, be you. Start relating to others from your vulnerable space so they can see you for who you are, so they can love you for who you are. That's gonna empower you so much. That's part of the power of the core, guys. It's being raw and real with our emotions, being raw and real with where we're at right now without trying to fake it because we're a coach, because we're a teacher, because we're a parent, because we're a blah, blah, blah. We're all of it and we're nothing at the same time. It's I am, guys. The I am, the power of the soul, has no compliment. It's just I am. It's very powerful. When you tap into the I am, breathe it in right now and repeat in your mind, I am. Breathe it into your heart. It's like perfection. It's like, yes, my essence. I am. I am. I am. Everything is perfect right now. From a soul level, everything is perfect. One more. Inhale. I am. I am. I am. And when you tap into that space, guys, that is the power of your soul. You have nothing to prove. You have nothing to show. You don't have to put masks. You see me showing up in Facebook. I share about anything. Anything that happens to me, I share it. I don't care. Because I know when I commit mistakes or I'm not in the greatest version of me, it's just my ego. It's just my personality. And there's nothing wrong with your personality, your ego. There's nothing bad with it. But there's a negative ego that brings you down and makes you live in an illusion. And there's the part of the ego that is supporting your purpose, your path, your, 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 your gifts right now. So it's important for us to remember to nurture our positive ego, which is the one that's related to your soul. And that's the one that is your truth. That is the one that makes you feel unstoppable. That is the one that makes you feel powerful. So now, after this mindset, after this inspiration that just came through, <laughs> now we're ready to rock and roll with the exercises, right guys? Now it's the real deal. We're going to enter the quantum flow, okay? The quantum flow. We're going to go into the quantum flow method. This is very basic quantum flow, just so you know, okay? We're working here with the nervous system. We're working here with the breath. If it's your first time, I tell you, I say it all the time. When we're holding the breath, don't hold it too much because you don't want to faint, right? You don't want to lose it. You don't want to feel anxious because you hold it too much thinking that it would be better for you. You got to feel what your limit is. Sometimes we, we hold it and it's just a little bit... Just, just that's good. That's good for today. And you can be opening up more and more. We use a lot of breath work in quantum flow, guys. If you can breathe, you can do quantum flow. If you can breathe, you can change your energy. If you can breathe, you can upgrade your life, every area of your life. I promise you guys. I've promised you, I've worked with people on wheelchairs, vegetable people that come, are my clients, or I do an activation and they do quantum flow and they're like 
having the biggest blast of their life just sitting and doing the breath work that I'm guiding. So if you have any problem that you can't even get up, you can't even move your, your body as some of you have messaged me, don't worry. Follow my breath, listen to my breath and do the best you can. Never force it, never strain yourself. It's not about pushing it too much. Today we're gonna push it more. Today we're gonna into, go into the fire. But you want your jaw relaxed, guys. The jaw, just so you know, the jaw is related to the back of your head and it's related to the energy that goes through your spine, through your nervous system, yeah? Real energy that flows through your nervous system is what we call biophotonic energy or what we call the inductance field in quantum physics. This energy is flowing through your spine all the way to the back of your head. And if you don't release the tensions in your jaw, and we'll be doing that a little bit, massaging your jaw and relaxing all these tensions, because we're, we're used to when we have in control, I'm in control, you know, I can do this, I've got this, you know, it's like rubbing the wheel. And that creates so much tension here. Oh my God, it hurts just to do that. I forgot what it was. But many people live like that. You know, if that's you, don't judge yourself. Just love yourself, but observe the pattern to tighten your jaw. And then that tightens your neck. And then that's why we have like monkeys hanging on our back, right? And we're like, oh, I don't know why. I need a massage. But it's because we're not being aware that we're contracting our body. That's why quantum flow is so good to expand yourself to turn into your full potential, awaken that radiancy, that love that you are right now, okay? So when we do the work, remember, don't hold it too much. Don't tense your jaw. Try to relax everything so you can start feeling or sensing the energy going into your frontal lobe, right? Because the energy tends to stay on the back, what we call the thalamus gate. It's the reptilian brain, which is the survival mode, which is like, there's not, there's not enough. I can't do this. I'm not good enough. Let me fight for it. Let me compete. Oh, that one has more than me. Oh, she does things better than me. Oh my God, my boyfriend is going to go with him because, because I'm not good enough. Like, oh those insecurities come because we're in survival mode. We're not in our power. So our power is not only our core. We're reconnecting our core with our brain. Corset, mindset. Corset and mindset. All right, guys? So when you tap into that, guys, and you open it up, you start opening to full bliss in your body. Okay, so are you ready now? No expectations. As we said, it could be uncomfortable, but maybe you are going to have blasts of bliss. Welcome it all every time. All right? So let's do this, guys. Oh, before we start, can you share? Can you share with your community to get them on and practice together? Because this is the practice. This is where we're going to go activate the energy and send this energy to humanity. We want as many people as we can in this vortex. So if you can just press the share button right now and just sharing your personal page. Don't care if people like it or don't like it or many people don't see it, it doesn't matter, but just create that share right now. You know, that's the only favor I'm asking you from everything that's flowing for you right now. Just press the share button so we can create a huge vortex together, guys. We're going deep here together. And the more people we have, the more powerful this is. All right, so let's do that. I'll give you a couple of seconds to share this with your community and rock it together. Bring more people in. I see the numbers going up. I see the numbers going up. That's good, guys. More people are jumping in. Yes, it's going up. It's going up, guys. Yes, it's going up. That's good. That's good. You share it and the numbers go up because people are, oh, what, what is this? What's happening? What, I want to be part of that. Okay, so welcome if you're just arriving. Don't worry. You can watch the replay after. We are now into a practice to awaken the core, guys. This is a practice to awaken your core. Your core are your gifts, is your energy, is your drive, is your passion, is your inspiration. And it's what we need right now on the planet. We're kind of low on that right now. <laughs> so we kind of need to wake this energy up in order to start expanding to a positive vibration in the whole planet. Beautiful, guys. So let's take a deep breath into the belly. Put your hands in your belly, right? Hands in your belly, just to feel that basic quantum flow breath. Expand your belly. And then incorporate the sound, just relaxing with that. Inhale as deep as you can. Hold it. Expand your belly, big Buddha belly. And exhale with the sound. 
let your nervous system just calm down. Let yourself feel safe and present and loving. One more. Hold it. Beautiful. Here we are grounded. Here we are connected. Connect with your intention. Now, if you want, bring your hands to your heart or just put the hands on the sides. It doesn't matter. Just focus your attention on your heart. Your energetic heart is at the center of your chest. Breathe into your belly and bring the attention. Expand your chest completely. Focus your attention in your heart. Connect with your intention. Waking up your gifts, waking up to deeper layers of your purpose, waking up to your power, to your passion, to your energy, to feeling inspired no matter what happens outside of you. Connecting with the power of the soul. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm here. I am present. I love life. I love myself. I am here to expand this love in every cell of my being. And so it is. Let's do an A ah together. Deep breath. A ah is the vibration of the heart. Just feel it. Ah. Beautiful, guys. There we go. Amazing. Amazing. Beautiful. Very simple. Very simple. Now, relax your hands. Remember you're connected to the center of the earth. Remember you're connected to the sun, to the stars. You don't even have to rationalize this or see it or feel it. Just know that it's always there. We are the bridge. We're the connection between these both energies, masculine and feminine energies that are always available to us. So from this space, guys, let's start clearing now a little bit of alchemy in through your breath. So you want to clear your throat. This is the purification. It's called Vishuddha the purification of whatever's in the way from the core all the way up to your throat. So this we do like this. We exhale through your mouth. We inhale. Exhale other side. Inhale. Exhale. Find a nice stretch in your neck. Release your tensions. Start going a little faster. At the end, fire breath. Careful with your neck, very soft and gentle. You're clearing your nervous system, guys, and you're reconnecting your left and the right side of your brain with this simple breath. Keep going, guys. Very simple, very profound, trust me. It's just the beginning. We're going to go super deep. Please follow all the steps so you can really get the blast and have a complete quantum flow session. Okay? Go faster. Clear your nervous system, open the space so your brain can oxygenate at its maximum potential, guys. Do you want an expansion in your brain? Do you want to wake up dormant parts of your brain? Go for it, guys. Awaken from the core all the way up into your frontal lobe, all the way up into your crown. Four more. Stay there. Stay there wherever you're at. Stay. No inhalation. Stay there. Inhale back to center. Hold it. Zip it through your mouth. Expand it. That's it, guys. Float. Let yourself float. Remember you have this. Is relaxed. You're relaxed. Don't force it too much. Exhale the other side. Hold it. Don't inhale. Come back to center. Zip it in. That's it, guys. Hold it. Remember your inner smile. Remember the energy you're cultivating right now through your breath. Yes. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Exhale with the sound. <sighs> Beautiful, guys. This is just alchemy. We're going through the second step of clearing whatever is on your field. Deep inhalation. 
Start coming forward. <sighs> Inhale. Get your spine going, even if it's just a little bit. <sighs> Move forward and back. You want to create that wave in your spine. We've been working on it every day. You want to create that flow. If your spine is in flow, if the spaces between your vertebrae are juiced up and there's liquid and there's oxygen and there's electric electricity flowing, your life is going to be much better. Trust me. The sinus are going to go into your brain with so many ideas, with so much creativity, with so much energy flowing through you. So keep going with the breath. Sail through your mouth. A little faster, guys. Follow your own rhythm, but get into the alchemist state of purifying yourself. Any emotion that's not aligned with the greatest version of you, with your greatest energy, with the highest thoughts, with the highest emotions, clear it out of your field. You've got this. Don't follow me. Follow your own rhythm. Always, guys. Don't get lost in me. Find your own that feels good, that feels blissful, that feels amazing. Seven more. Two more. Exhale all the air out. Stay down. No inhalation. Inhale. Come back. Feel every cell with oxygen. Hold it. Hold it. Remember, you're rewiring your whole nervous system here. It's quantum physics, guys. No woo-woo thing here. Stay there. Hold it. Relax. Relax your jaw. Relax your neck. Exhale with the sound. Ah, relax. Relax. Let it flow in your body. Whatever your body wants to do, let it flow. It's all about flow. When you learn to flow in your body, you learn to flow in your life. There's, there's no separation between your physical, energetic practice and your lifestyle. It's all the same, guys. That's why we do this every day. Tune into it. Five minutes at least. Depends on how deep you want to go. Inhale. Expand your arms. Again, through your mouth. Remember to relax. Relax your jaw. Relax your neck. You can move your head from side to side. Zip it in more. Open more space to receive. Yes, I am open. I am receptive. Yes. And now exhale. Let it flow. Let it flow. It comes through your crown. You can see it. You can visualize it. You can just feel it or just know that it's coming. Crown, heart, down to the core, down to the legs, down to the earth. One more, guys. Inhale. Open up. Open up. Open up to the energy of the sun. Right now, connect intentionally to the sun. You are the sun. You are as powerful as the sun. <sighs> Hold it. Expand it. Relax. Relax your jaw. Float. Float. Receive. I am. I am. I am. Exhale. <sighs> Let it flow through like a golden shower of light through your crown, your brain, all the way down to your neck, to your heart, to your core. Down to your hips, down to the earth. <laughs> Simple, right? But powerful, guys. Alchemy breath. This is like the simplest alchemy breath we have in quantum flow. But just feel it, how it just creates a different level for you, right? A different perception. Give me a yes if you're with me right now. Give me a yes and get ready. Get ready for the core, guys. We've cleared ourselves. We're purified. Quantum flow works with the energy in spirals, just so you know. It's biohacking the nervous system by creating a spiral in your body. So that's why we go to the crown, then now we come into the core, right? I mean, we go into the neck purification and now we come into the core. That's why you need to follow the steps, guys, because this is something different than you've ever done. It looks like yoga. It looks like, you know, regular breath work. It looks like many things, but it, it's got its own methodology, right? Give me a yes if you're feeling it with me. Yes, amazing, guys. Amazing. All right. I see you, Instagram. I see you, Facebook. I see you, YouTube. Amazing. I love it. Yes. All right, guys. Now, hands together, hands together. Now, 
Feel the power of your core when you exhale. Just activate your hands together. Exhale. Navel in. Activate. Activate really strong muscles. Now inhale. Expand. Exhale, activate. As if the, the air is dense. Activate your hands. Feel all your muscles. Remember your jaws. Relax. Inhale. Hold your hands there. Exhale, activate more. Core active. Yes. Inhale, expand. Open up. More space to receive. More space. Pulsation. Hold it. And now activate. Feel your muscles. Feel your inner strength, your inner power. Wake it up, guys. Wake it up. Now keep it there. Keep it there. Core, you're working on the base of the spine, the, the muscles on the pelvic floor, and you're working on the navel. Navel in when you exhale. You've got this, guys. Sweat it out a little bit. Wake it up. Exhale the air out. Keep it there. Inhale, hold. Keep squeezing. Squeeze your belly. Squeeze your hands. Squeeze. Relax your jaw. And now exhale. Expand it. Let it flow. Inner smile. Just feel. Just feel. Uh, release. Release your hands. Shake it off a little bit. Shake your arms. Shake your, uh, your shoulders. <sighs> shake your jaw. Always release tensions in your body. You don't want tensions in your body, guys. No good. What for? <laughs> shake it off. <laughs> All right. Good. <laughs> Again, hands together. Now we're going to come from our core, guys. Underneath your navel. My navel's right here. Underneath the navel. Inhale all the way up. Inhale. Liquid golden light coming through your spine. You can visualize it. You can feel it or just know that it's happening. It's the electromagnetic frequency that you're activating from the, the base of your spine. Hold it into your crown. <sighs> Squeeze it. Squeeze your belly. Squeeze your navel. Squeeze your abdominal muscles. Everything. Relax your jaw. If you can smile even better. Expand. Let it expand. Let yourself open up. Let yourself laugh. <laughs> Whatever flows, guys. It could be uncomfortable. It could be fun. It could be blissful. Anything is welcome. Let's keep going, guys. You're expanding your electromagnetic field which surrounds you. Yeah? It's basics of the inductance field expanding out. Pure quantum physics, guys. We're not playing woo-woo things here, okay? Hands together, activate. Underneath your navel. Exhale. Keep that activation in your belly. Now, inhale with the belly squeeze. Squeeze all the abdominal muscles. Inhale all the way up, guys. You've got this. Hold it. Find a blissful state, guys. Don't be straining it, please. Relax yourself a little bit. Squeeze as much as you can, but from a blissful space, please. Hold it and expand it. Let it flow, let it flow, let it flow, let it flow. Hands together. Now interlace your fingers. <laughs> Good guys, yes, we're together in this, guys. Waking up your power, waking up your passion. You've got this, guys. Together, come on, even if it's uncomfortable. How much do you wanna liberate yourself? You wanna free yourself. We're freeing up your nervous system right now, guys. All the memories from the nervous system, but that's what quantum flow is. You're letting go of your past so you can write your story. That's why this is a manifestation method. It goes beyond embodiment. It's the science and art of manifestation, okay? Entering the quantum field. That's why it's called quantum flow, connecting to your intention. 
Okay, so remember your intention, right? Here together with this, all right? I'm with you, open your eyes, feel your presence, feel your energy. <laughs> Even if it's crazy eyes, look at me, it's okay. That's light coming through you, that's fire coming through you, that's power coming through you. Ready, inhale, exhale. Activate all the muscles, inhale, exhale. Come on, wild guys. Ah, wake it up. Wake up that inner lion. You've got it. I know you have an inner lion in you. Ah, come on. You've got that masculine energy. Ah, one more. Ah, okay. Keep that activation. Inhale. Bring it all the way up into your crown. Top your crown so you know you're waking up your frontal lobe right there. Zip it in. Squeeze. Relax your jaw. Smile. Smile in the most challenging situations. Smile. And open up. Oh, oh, let it flow. Let it flow. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Shake it off. <sighs> Shake it off. Yes, no tensions in my body. <laughs> let's relax our jaw a little bit, guys. Oh, let's remember to release this from our jaw. So much tension, so much control we're carrying. Yeah, from the jaw, take it back to the head, to the neck. And activate it right here, a little massage there in the back of your neck. Come on, let that energy flow away from your reptilian brain all the way into your frontal lobe, guys. That's how it rolls. That's where your inner genius is in the frontal lobe. That's all we're doing here. Yeah, and now bring it up, activate it here, top of your crown right there. Ah, wake it up, guys, wake it up, yeah. Uh, good now inhale expand stretch hold it zip it in expand exhale receive let it flow let it flow let it flow let it flow, let it flow. thank you thank you thank you connect with your intention Connect with your intention. Yes, I am alive. Yes, I am awake. Yes, I'm, I, am a, I am a being full of light. I am a light being. I am a divine being. I am a soul living a human experience. Thank you. I awaken the power of my soul. I awaken the gifts of my soul. I say yes to my purpose, to my highest driven purpose. Yes, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Full gratitude, guys, for whatever you want to be grateful. Always coming back to gratitude. All right, here we go, guys. Let's go deeper into the core. You ready? All right, inhale, open. You want to open? Exhale, now activate. Strong. Strong, 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 strong. Forward. Chin in, navel in, inhale, exhale, activate. Inhale, exhale as if the air was dense, guys, go. But remember to relax, enjoy. If you're not used to doing physical stuff, embodiment stuff, find a blissful way that feels good for you. Don't run away from it, guys. Find a way that feels good for you. Many people stop going to the gym or stop doing yoga or stop doing any physical practice because they never learn how to love it. So whatever you're doing, find the bliss. What is your rhythm? What is your power? How does it feel good for you? Come on, three more.
One more. That's it, guys. Hold it right there. Hold it. Are you with me? Open your eyes. Come on. With me. Feel that energy of your core. Yes, you are powerful. Feel your inner lion, your lioness. Wake up that unstoppable drive. Burn your core. Let it burn. It's good, guys. Navel in. Feel it while you're breathing. You're breathing, but this activating your midline, the center of your body, activates all the muscles and rewires your core. All right, guys, you've got this. You've got this, yes. <laughs> Come on. Okay, one more. Now inhale, hands together, bring it up into the core. Zip it in, squeeze your core. Squeeze all the energy accumulated in the nervous system, goes all the way up into the ground, into your frontal lobe, and expand it. Let it flow, let it flow, however it flows for you, it's okay, relax, no control. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Always in gratitude, thank you, thank you, thank you. Whew. Inhale all the way up. Expand it, no more squeezing on the belly. Just expansion, this is radiancy, guys. You're opening to radiancy right now. Expand, expand, expand more, even more energetically. See yourself touching the stars, completely opening up to the whole universe, and then exhale, receive. Ah. One more time together, guys. Inhale gently, take your time, enjoy. No squeezing in your belly right now. Zip it in, expand it, open it up. Thank you, full of gratitude, completely open. Exhale. Receive it through your crown, through your neck, bring it into your heart, breathe it into your heart, just with your intention, just with your love, with your attention. Wherever your attention goes, your energy flows. The heart is the center of love, of abundance, of compassion. Unconditional love, guys. Prosperity. Yes, I open up to freedom, to open my full gifts right now. Let yourself feel and open up to your gifts right now, guys. What is calling you? What is it that you love, that you haven't done? Do you like singing? Do you like uh, dancing? Do you like writing? Do you, do you want to speak out to the world in stages? Do you want to guide retreats and workshops for others? Do you want to write a book? Do you want to show up more in social media? Do you want to share more of your story? Do you want to build your house? Do you want to plant a garden? What is calling you right now? Open up to that, guys, and say yes. Say it out loud. Open yourself and say yes. Yes, <laughs> yes, say yes to your purpose, say yes to your gifts, say yes to who you are, voice it guys, yes, you deserve it, yes, you are here to live the best life ever, yes, I say yes to love, I say yes to health, I say yes to life right now, thank you, thank you, thank you, yes. <laughs> It's all about emotions, guys, because emotion is energy in motion. When you get a positive emotion in your field, feel it. You feel you're capable of anything. That's when you rewire your whole nervous system to be aligned to the highest energy possible for you. <laughs> all right, guys, so let's, um, let's do a little closing. Yeah, we've been a long time here. So let's do a little closing now. Um, I just want to, you know, my closings are kind of like five to ten minutes. <laughs> it's not that we're closing right now. <laughs> Give me a yes if you're feeling me. Yes, write it down if you're feeling me before we do the close down, guys. Ah, amazing. Feeling so good with all of you guys. So good. You're so committed. Give me a yes if you are committed to going deeper, to waking up your core once and for all, committed to who you are, to living the best life ever, guys to accepting that freedom is within you. It's not outside of you, guys. Stop looking for freedom outside. It's inside of you. You're already free. 
And you can tap into that freedom with this work, with any work that opens up your energy, guys. So thank you for saying yes to yourself. Thank you for saying yes to love. Thank you for saying yes to freedom. Yes, from within. So many yeses. I feel you there, guys. Yes, it's a total yes for life. Falling back in love with life. Rising in love with life. Yes, I see you, Instagram. I see you, Facebook. I see you, beautiful people in uh, YouTube too. Amazing amazing guys so good okay guys so i just want to remind you please this method that i'm sharing with you um it's 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 for you to do it yourself guys but please i see some people just coming into my live streams and taking the exercises and then teaching them without really knowing what's happening guys there's a whole methodology i can't teach here and if any of you have any problem and you send me a message or something, I know how to help you guys. This can really mess up your nervous system if you don't know how to do it. And I even have sometimes students that come and do my trainings, but not on quantum flow. And then they go and teach it, naming it differently. This is lack of integrity, guys. Like it's how you're showing up in the world. Like, no, this is not just a breath work I'm teaching. Like, it's a methodology, it's quantum physics, it's science and art. If you want to teach this, please let me know. We do quantum flow trainings. You can go deep with us, a beautiful community of committed souls that want to learn this for themselves and to teach it to their communities. They're teaching it online, they're traveling the world, teaching this, helping people. So if that's your call, please reach out to me, I'll help you. But please don't teach this as if you know it just because you did an activation with me. Even if you're a yoga teacher, I honor you, I respect you. Even if you're a Qigong teacher, like I have lots of yoga teachers and Qigong masters. I have three Qigong masters right now, two, sorry, two, uh, right now in the training, like really tapped into the energy and they're learning so much. Like it's different than all these practices. So it may look similar guys, but it's different. It's a whole science and art. There's like three levels on this thing. It's, it's huge, so please. I give you everything, but I ask you to commit, to keep this for yourself, to do it for yourself. If you wanna go deep, reach out to me. Let's don't mess people up. If we're gonna teach this and share this to the world, let's teach it the best way possible. Please, guys, let's have integrity. I see so many people out of integrity out there, guys, teaching stuff that they don't even know what they're teaching, you know? Saying they're shamans because they went to an ayahuasca ceremony and they received their shamans. You know, saying they're coaches just because they just finished the training of one weekend and now they're coaches. Guys, it takes time to build it up, you know? It takes time. It took me 25 years to put this method together, guys. Please. It looks simple and fun. I make it very fun and simple. But you can't imagine the science that's behind this. So I need to share this because I'm sharing this for free. I'm opening myself. But then I'm seeing people sharing it out there in a shitty way. They don't even know what they're doing. <laughs> You know, so, so please, man, please, come on, let's be integral, let's commit to be integral in our lives, in everything we do, you know? Don't say you're a money coach and you're broke. Come on, I have people, money coaches, coming to my trainings and saying, man, I can't even pay you, can you? And I'm like, man, but you're a money coach. You just did a, you just did a, fa a, 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 a Facebook Live saying, like, all the money you've made in your life. What? what? Come on. <laughs> man, the more humble and real you are, the more prosperous you will be. You know, the more humble and real you are where you're at right now and, and, and you nurture that, the more you will flow in life. I promise you guys, you don't have to fake it till you make it. Let go of that. That's old stuff. That's old paradigm. We're in another level right now. Okay? So let's shake off that. If this is heavy energy for you and you're looking at yourself like now, like, oh, I do that, you know, I do that with my partner. Maybe I, I hide things or I'm false or I'm, you know, faking to be someone that I know. You know, we, we do that. We all do that. That's ego. And it's okay. But guys, let's release it. Okay? Let's let it go. And I want to do some shaking now to release it together. All right, guys? So get ready. <laughs> if there's any lack of integrity right now, let's do it. Get up, please. Get up. Yeah. All right. You ready? Shake it off. We did it yesterday. Super simple. Yeah? And just shake it off. Start with your hands. This feels really good, as you know. Animals do it. You're shaking. You're moving your joints. Now, bend your knees also. And just shake it off, guys. Yeah. 
just like that. Shake it off. Ah, 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 ah. Bring some sound, you know, enjoy your shaking. Let it go, guys. This feels so good. Why are you carrying tensions in your body? Come on. <laughs> Go a little crazy. It's okay to be crazy. Why do we hold on so much? Close the door so nobody hears you. It's okay. Or maybe don't do sounds, but shake it off. If you can, do the sound. I recommend you. Guys, this is really quantum physics because you're moving all the energy accumulated in your joints that's calcified, that's not active, right? It's, it gets electrified and then it starts flowing in your system. That's why you feel so good with it, right? So just shake it off. Any tension. <laughs> good, right? How good does that feel, guys? Okay, last one, last exercise. <laughs> I may lose you some of you here or you may just like find it so amazing. It's the easiest one of them all but sometimes we have trouble doing this. So I invite you to go for it because it's, it's really amazing. It's really amazing um, to like, let it flow. So you'll see me and you'll understand. You wanna invoke that inner child that laughs for, for no reason, right? So you're like, from your core, you're like, This is the best core work ever, guys. So you force it a little bit, but then let yourself be contagious with this. Let it flow, guys. Let it flow. <laughs> Laughter is the best medicine, guys. It's okay guys I lost some of you it's okay you know it's a little too crazy for some people but if you get me you know the language of the inner child you know that laughter can heal so much and it releases so much tension that you have in your core guys it's so good they, they have some yoga that's laughter yoga that's just laughing that's just laughing for one hour for all the reasons or no reason you know when you can laugh for no reason and you can laugh for yourself when you're like being hard on yourself or you're gonna fight with your partner or something and it's like oh man can we just laugh and you just laugh breaks all the patterns in your mind in your nervous system to be always the same way so it's good to master the laughter guys so I leave you right there you know this exercise you can share with your friends please just just laugh you know it's so simple it's like a, the, it's just 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 laugh just let it flow <laughs> oh my god guys you guys are amazing thank you for holding space for me too and and I've never done the laugh therapy I usually do this laugh therapy guys in my retreats where you know we know each other already we go so deep right it's a full community or our online workshops that we do we're so deep because we share our deepest stuff and we support each other. We love each other. Like there's so much safety, right? So we do this laughter exercise, but I've never done it in a Facebook live, in an Instagram live where whoever can come and say like, what's this crazy guy doing? Like I'm going to unfollow him. <laughs> it's too crazy. He's just laughing his head off. You know, it's okay. I risk it for you guys. I risked it so we could laugh together. All right. So give me a yes if you liked it. Give me a smile if you laughed with me. <laughs> oh my God, life is so fun, guys. And when we learn to laugh because of nothing and have fun because of nothing, guys, it's just, it's just beautiful. It's pure beauty. You're beautiful the way you are, guys. Remember that. You're beautiful inside. You're beautiful outside. Feel how beautiful you are. Feel how radiant you are right now. If you did the whole session with me, you can feel right now 
or sense the difference between before and after, right? Maybe you also feel uncomfortable because you moved stuff or because you couldn't laugh. It's okay, guys. That's the serious part of us that's controlling. Just observe it and know that there's work to do. It's all good, all right? So bringing our hands to the heart, connecting with our heart, and just like being grateful. Being grateful, guys, for this time together. Being grateful with ourselves. Take a deep breath. Ah, so much gratitude. Connect with your intention. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, I love myself so much the way I am. I promise to let go of judgments and criticism and anything that's holding me back. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Now connect with the love with your family, guys. Feel your family right now here with you. The bliss that you're feeling right now, the energy you're feeling, share it with your family. Visualize it. Or know that you're sharing it with them just with your intention. Don't worry about being able to visualize or not. It's really about, with your intention, sharing that. All your family, your ancestors, all the children in your family, everyone, Thank you, thank you, thank you. I love you. I forgive you. I open up to the love that unites us as a family. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Mm. Now share with your community, guys. Visualize this energy expanding. Start expanding your arms if you can. Just opening up space all around your heart and feel this energy going all through your neighborhood, through your community, wherever you're at through the country that you're at right now, the whole planet right now is filled with your love, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yes, I am open, I am receptive. I know I'm a reflection of humanity. I open up to all this love flowing through me, to all this light flowing through me. I am here to contribute to the evolution of humanity. I'm here to serve in whatever way I can. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I surrender to the service from my soul. I surrender to the highest purpose of my being. I am here, I am open, I am available. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Infinite universe, infinite love, infinite energy. Ah, thank you. Let's do an ah together, guys. Let's share this through the sound, the ah resonating in the heart. Ah. so much Woo. all right guys beautiful beautiful time together beautiful beautiful time to share tomorrow we have a great gift for you guys tomorrow I'm bringing my partner Regan and we're doing a whole activation give me a yes if you're excited guys give me a heart whatever you feel if this feels amazing for you Regan is coming in the house doing her whole energetic architecture for us so just so you know get ready because we're doing an activation with together, yin yang flowing. So you're gonna be moving, you're gonna be doing embodiment, and then you're gonna be also rewiring yourself through energetic architecture, guys. Yes, we're going deeper. There's two more days to go. Tomorrow we go deep into that, guys. And ah, share it with your friends, share it with your family, share it with your community, guys. Let's, let's grow this vortex even more. To, tomorrow is gonna be even more powerful. You've seen how we've been building it up, right? We've been building it up, guys. One hour training, guys. Yeah, you know, with all my love, with all my love, unconditional love, guys. Let's share this love. Now go shine this love with your family. Go shine this love with the world. Do a Facebook Live. Um, share a post. Like, share this love with the girl, with the world, guys. The world needs you in your highest self. The, the world needs you with your light. The world needs you with your gifts. The world needs you right now to show up, guys. Stop playing small. Let the world know who you are. Let the world know what's your purpose. One task I'll leave you guys. Write down now. Let yourself dream. What is your purpose in this earth? Whatever that is, whatever you love, that you don't, you, maybe you can't even figure it out. Just write it down. 
What's your dream? How do you want to be in this life? You want to be traveling the world? You want to be growing your garden? You want to be uh, singing or acting or, or, or writing or, or, or serving others or being a quantum flow trainer and helping others like I do, helping people from stages and from you know, retreats and workshops and whatever. Like Whatever you want to do, write it down, guys. Write it down on your journal. Let yourself dream with it. Feel it while you write it down. Feel it. Breathe it. Thank you. Say thank you. It's already happening. Yes, I am aligned to this right now. The whole universe conspires around me creating this, manifesting this in my life. Remember quantum flow? It's a method of manifestation. It's the science and art of manifestation. And one of the things we do is like we tap into the emotion of like, yes, it's already happening. It's already done. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. But when you write it down, you're connecting your brain through your hand. You're connecting with your future self, bringing it to the now. You're rewiring your whole nervous system while you're coming into the high level emotion of gratitude. Full gratitude with what you are manifesting. Full gratitude with who you are. You write it down and it just expands, guys. It feels so good. So have fun. Please follow. It's the first task I leave you. Please follow, okay? The second task, share this, guys. Let's get more people these last two days. Let's have a blast out. Tag people in here. Share the video. Let's have a blast out. So we're sharing so much energy with the whole world, all right? Mucho amor, familia, pura vida, de mi corazón a tu corazón, from my heart to your heart. I see you, I honor you, I respect you, I send you all my love. Thank you for being who you are. I'm here to support you. Have the best day ever. <laughs>